How to Identify an HIV Rash Hello guys, this is Mark Medical's teaching about HIV AIDS infection like the latest HIV cure news, HIV treatment, HIV tests, and ways HIV is transmitted. In today's video, you will learn about the following. 1. When does HIV rash appear? 2. What are the many possible causes of skin rash? 3. Where do HIV rashes appear? 4. How to identify an HIV rash? 5. Is HIV rash itchy or not? 6. How to treat HIV rash? 7. Bonus, when are HIV tests conclusive? As a bonus, I will talk about the time when HIV tests are conclusive, so watch till the end to know everything. Alright, let us get started. 1. When does HIV rash appear? First of all, having a body skin rash does not mean you have HIV. Everybody, HIV positive or negative has the potential of suffering from a skin rash in your lifetime. But, if you recently had HIV exposure through unprotected intercourse, sharing drug-injecting devices and others, a skin rash two to four weeks after exposure could be one of the HIV symptoms or signs. This HIV rash typically occurs alongside other early HIV symptoms like fever, sore throat, fatigue, night sweats, cough and others. So, HIV rash typically shows up after two to four weeks, and lasts for a few days to weeks too. 2. What are the many possible causes of skin rash? There are many causes of rash out there. The most causes include poor personal hygiene, skin infections due to bacteria, viruses, fungi, and allergic reactions. Hypersensitivity to certain medicines like HIV treatment, penicillins, and sulfurs also could cause you an itchy rash. You may also react to certain foods like certain proteins and fats. Weather conditions like extreme sunlight and coldness also could predispose you to a body itchy rash. 3. Where do HIV rashes appear? HIV rash usually appears on the abdomen, legs, face, and arms and features a flat, red area covered in small red bumps. Generally, every part of your body is capable of having a skin rash so, this rash will usually appear differently in different people. 3. How to identify an HIV rash There are absolutely no symptoms that tell if you have HIV or not. Please, do not use symptoms to diagnose HIV, since every HIV positive or negative person can easily suffer from the same symptoms. The only way to know if you have HIV AIDS or not is by having an HIV test. But, HIV rash as I said appears 2 to 4 weeks after your exposure. Also note that, any person living with HIV could experience a skin rash at any time because their body's defense mechanism is already weakened by the virus. People who are living with HIV can easily be attacked by bacteria, viruses, and other rash-causing germs. Studies have shown that, at least more than 60% HIV-positive people have a higher risk of getting a skin rash. If you are troubled by any skin rash, See our recommended health products in the description section below this video. 5. Is HIV rash itchy or not? HIV rash is red with slightly raised lesions and very itchy. It will also cause either red or dark spots depending on your skin color. It can cover part or whole of your body depending on how serious it is. This rash is not transmittable from person to person just like another bacterial or fungal-related skin rash. If you already have AIDS or advanced stage of untreated HIV, then your rash will be likely very itchy, with dark or red-spotted skin. Dermitis and proligo are itchy skin diseases common in people with AIDS. 6. How to treat HIV rash Treatment of HIV rash is a bit not straightforward because establishing the cause is not so easy to isolate and then treat. HIV rash is treated by taking your antiretroviral drugs or ARVs. Skin rash due to HIV medicine can be treated by either changing your medications or temporarily stopping the medicines if the rash is causing you peeling skin. Your doctor will prescribe you medicines like weak steroids or antihistamines if your itchy rash is due to certain medications, foods, and reactions to weather changes. 
The best way to avoid the itching is by avoiding all things that make your rash worse like certain clothes, certain body lotions, certain medications, and foods to which your body reacts. If you experience anybody rash, the only way to know if it is associated with HIV or not is by taking an HIV test. If your test is negative, then the cause of your symptoms is a different disease your doctor should you help to discover. As a bonus, you guys keep on asking me the same questions concerning HIV testing. Here are a few points you need to know today. 1. The maximum HIV window period today is 90 days. The window period is not 6 months as it used to be before, because we have strong advanced HIV test kits today. 2. HIV RNA tests and 4th generation HIV tests are conclusive from 45 to 50 days after infection. 3. Antibody-only rapid HIV tests are conclusive after 90 days. 4. If an HIV test is conclusive, it means the highest accuracy and therefore you should not repeat the test. 5. An HIV test that is conclusive for example at 45 days is also conclusive at any date after 45 days e.g. 60 days, 80 days 5 months, 5 years etc. 6. There is no good research to know the accuracy of HIV tests before 45 days or beyond 90 days. So, no good answers to some of your questions are available. 7. If you tested using HIV RNA tests or fourth generation HIV test, then the window period is shorter at 45 to 50 days. Only rapid tests have the longest window period of up to 90 days. Having said that, do not miss our recommended health products like immune boosters in the description section below this video. Hope the question, how to identify an HIV rash, has been well answered.